Thought my wife was coming, but she's not. I'm gonna close the door. Well, happy Sunday, y'all. In honor of the weather, I thought I would show off my beautiful tooth I won at auction last year at my wife's Christmas party. I thought it would be aesthetically pleasing to play the part. Since I'm growing back my beautiful beard, Chuck made me shave off. I'm also wearing a authentic Eddie Bauer Squatch shirt to uh, shout out to the, I don't know, things in the bush. Anyways, I have a few things I'm going to do today, quickly. Now, I don't know if he ever got a thank you, but I found this amongst my items. And it comes from Mark M. Zentico, or however you want to say it. I know it's Mark. We're Android fan. So I'm not too sure. It says, hey, Daryl, here are a few for you, Mark. And, uh, yeah. So I found it over here in the mess. And uh, we got an Xavier McDaniel for kiddo. We got an Xavier Rhodes for kiddo. Xavier Rhodes for kiddo. And a nice Xavier Henry rated rookie card for Xavier. So, shout out to Mark. Thanks, buddy. I, uh, I will add them to his little pile that's on the other side of the desk. So then the next pile I have here um scratch my head a little bit um because it's got I'm guessing maybe this has something to do with my want list Ryan O'Reilly Ryan Donato marquee rookie of Josh Curry a upper deck energy insert of McJesus and a Charlene Labonte autographed Team Canada card oversized. That, my friends, is sweet. I like that. So I think these are from Chuck because I do believe I do believe that's who got this. So these are most likely on a wanted list. So I am going to leave them in there. My son is coming in the room. Yes? I actually made something. You made something? I'm making a video for my friends on TCDB and the entire wild, wide world. So. Well, they can see it as well. What did you make? It's a cardboard robot. Ooh, he made a cardboard robot. So there's this hat in the back. And then twist it. And you wind it up and what does he do? You're taking over the world. Good job, buddy. Fist bumps. I I followed the constructions completely and I had every piece. Instructions. But, instructions. But here no there. This these two parts were hard to get on at the exact same time and it was the last piece that I was putting on. I seen you working away on something in your bedroom. Uh, yeah, it was this. Cool. That is awesome. Now everyone on the internet also knows about it. Absolutely. So, um, on to my cards again. So, uh, I've been telling Chuck about these for, I don't know how long, probably since I met him. When I was collecting the score back in the day, 1314, I lucked out and I got Marcus Foligno. Number 51, base. I know he hates horizontal, but then on the back, it's black ink. Then I lucked out and got the base red ink. Then I lucked out even more and I got the gold. I lucked out even more and got the red. And to finish it all off, I found the rarest one, the black, for sale online to finish the rainbow. So 
For Charles, my friend, in his next batch, you will receive all five Marcus Feligno 1314 Rainbow. It's the least I can do for my best buddy out there. Okay, so a long time ago, when I was still in the little bit of money, and I was still getting injury insurance money, I had bought some cards from Flying V Cards and Breaks. Big shout out. I can almost guarantee you that there'll be a card in here I'll show. And I had bought some stuff off him, but when my money ran out, he begrudgingly understood my plight. And it's taken me from September till now, paying it off a little bits at a time with my wife's permission to get what I had waiting. So, with you, I'm going to see what it is that I purchased. I don't even remember. I'm sure it was like a stack sale that he had. So, empty. Let's see what we got. Now, Mike, he's a great guy, absolute great guy, and if I still had money, I would definitely be joining his break still. So for any of you who are interested, his name's Mike Lang out of BC, Canada. All his breaks are in Canadian dollars, and he will ship to the United States. So, check him out. There's your gracious plug, my friend. And let's see what it is that I bought. This video is going to end up being long. So we have a Mike Green dual jersey swatch of artifacts to 150 for the 10-11 season. Uh, I got myself a Pavel Zacha, Zaka, Zacha, RPA, SPX, 1617. Uh, serial number 299. Then, oh, look at what I got here. I know who that's for. Victor Olofsson. It is an overtime. Looks like uh, base rookies. Number 164. That's for Charles. Then we have a Rod Langway dual jersey artifacts from 1819. Serial number to 99. Nice classic old jersey. And then let's see. Again, I don't remember how and when I went about buying all these, but I did. Oh, it's another one. What do we got here? We have an Artifacts to 75 of Charlie Coyle. It is a jersey patch to, like I said, 75. Charlie's with Minnesota. Oh, yes. Got some gooders. Ty Smith. Team Canada, 2017 Upper Deck Gold Exclusive to 199. Born and raised in Lloydminster, Saskatchewan. Plays for the New Jersey Devils. Then we have, oh, I remember getting this one now. James Neal Clappers. Uh, it's an insert parallel serial numbered. To 25. Very rare. Very rare. Because it's not only overtime, but it's also a parallel. And then we have Michael McLeod, an RPA, well, it's a pre RPA, Team Canada RPA, whatever, to $3 to 125. So it's gold. Michael McLeod, I do believe he plays for New Jersey as well. Little bits of this and that. 
What do we got here? Oh, we got ourselves a shadow box of Pavel Zaka. Zaka. Another RPA, 10 of 99. Nice looking card. Another RPA. I'm always partial to my Devils still. It's one of the first teams I liked, but it was because of Alyssa Milano. <laughs> I still have the poster of her posting and tore up jeans in a New Jersey Devils. I think it's a home jersey. I think it's white, the white, green, and red. We have an access jersey card of Drake Batherson. Yes, more Ottawa. Then we have, oh wow, <laughs> I'd love, I'd love to give it to you, my friend, but I think this one has got to go up for sale. I don't even know what the swatches are from, but it is a Ross, uh, Rasmus Darlene Trilogy Honorable, Honorary Triple Swatches. I, I don't even, I can't even tell you what the pieces are from. One is, I don't know. I honestly, I don't even remember buying this. That's how long ago. 20 of 25. Hmm. Oh, well. We got three of those Victor Olufsen's. Oh. Hey, guess what? Are they the same year? Yeah. 1920, 1920. Chucky, you get a photo variation. Side by side. One is a variation. Home or away? No, home and away. Backs also show the difference with the pictures being different. So, not too bad, Chucky. I'll keep the last, last one for myself. Oh, then we got a program of excellence gold, Ty Smith. Another one of our local boy. Hopefully he sticks and lasts a long time in the league. Oh, hey, what else do we got? Oh, we got a Vancouver Canuck of some sort coming up. I must have gotten Pavel stuff pretty cheap because another Pavel Zacha, Zaka, RPA, from SPX, no SP game used, this time 45 of 49. Nice swatch there. So that would probably be considered gold or, or spectrum or something like that. What else do we got going on here? Here we got a Premier Signatures, Montreal, Andrew Shaw. That is from 1617. Then we have a Zach McEwen red jersey swatch rookie from Allure. Not serial numbered, but I have no idea if this is rarer than the others. Where it stands in the old Allure playbook. Sorry. This is going on quite a while. I keep leaning off camera again. There we go. I hate tape. There it is right there. David's probably going to be jealous if he watches this video. Last little bundle. Well, this was a good card for a Canadian team a little while ago. But I'm not going to complain because it's still a Blue Ice Rookie 
199 of none other than just traded Patrick Oine to the Columbus Blue Jackets. Another Victor Olsson, but and then we got a Clappers of Jerome McGinley. We got one, two, three, four of those actually. Must be just throw-ins, I'm guessing. And I got another Victor Olofsson. Then we have a Johan Larson blue for Chuckles. Overtime blue parallel. And another Victor Olofsson rookie card. Last but not least, I have a Jesper Boquist. Trilogy Rookie Premiers, 49 of 49 Red Parallel RPA. So, there you go, guys. That's what I had bought off him previous to September. So, back in the summertime, when I was still getting insurance checks of some sort. And... He was gracious enough to wait again. I thank you, Mike, for waiting for so long. Feel bad, you're uh, off my list. There's still others waiting. I will get to you again. Shout out, Flying V Cards and Breaks. Find them on those spots right there. Mike's a good guy. So, um, thanks to Mark. Thanks to Chuck. Enjoy when you get them, Chuck. I'll probably wait till I get a bigger stack. And uh, yeah, I'm staying warm. Bearded Wonder. Go Squatch. Go Oilers. No booze, just sweetener. Yes. Oilers, Oilers everywhere. On this note, I am going to say adios. For those of you who need to stay warm, stay warm, stay safe. For those of you who are smart, wear a mask, follow the rules, keep people like my mom alive and kicking. Later. Bye.